cause she fine and she got dough. Uh -huh. At the Bellagio, I got <laughs> She want a model for for show, let me call Joe. Uh -huh. Bring your best friend, what you want to call bro? What up, though? This kid, man. I think y'all know me, uh... For music and models, for sure, magazine. My nigga, Dose McFashion. I'm with Marilyn Mello. Woo! <laughs> What's up? What's up? Where you from? Uh, originally, Dominican Republic. Santo Domingo. What? Santo Domingo, La República Dominicana. What that? What, what, what the fuck was that? That means the capital of the Dominican Republic. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's an island. All right, we're going to get into these questions, man. So, uh, let's say, my nigga McFasher sent me some questions. He say, so you have a thing for outdoors. You like hiking? You enjoy it? Yes, I enjoy hiking. I love the workout that involves it and, you know, the scenery that comes along with it. Okay. So, like, where do you be hiking at and shit? Around my way, I usually do, like, Cooper River. Um, that's not really a hike. It's really a walk. Or I just go like up to the Poconos and like walk around. Uh, Philly that's area. That, but... Philly area, yeah, that's where the mountains are. Okay. And they say you started time in the military. Yeah. Gangsta. <laughs> I you served, a soldier. Served like three to four years. So you uh, you were suiting up in that shit and Mm-hmm. I have pictures too. Damn. And I be seeing pictures too. I be seeing Females looking sexy as hell wearing that shit, but uh, how was that done? How was the experience? It was life changing. I feel like you don't know who you are until you, like, I feel like I forget who I was before. What made you, like, really get into that shit? Like, free college, I don't really look deeply into it. I feel like when you, you know, free college, I'm straight out of high school. That's like, pretty as hell, and I wouldn't, you know, nobody wouldn't expect you to be doing that shit, like holding the AR and. Mm -hmm. You hear the AR and all that shit. Bombs and everything, yeah. Really? Grenades. Yeah. We get shot at, honey. This oh. is part of our training. You done been through more shit than me, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> How you get into modeling? Uh, I was found in a restaurant one night at Duff Rusco's in Philadelphia. The owner of Barefoot, his name is Yuri, he uh, came up to me and was like, you should model for my brand. I was like, okay. Well, not really okay. I did some research first and then I went for it, but... And then a photographer named Avery, uh, Avery and Ma Michael on Instagram, he actually did my first shoot. And after that, everything just snowballed. Um, like the face of Kicks USA and Nike and all that shit. Mm -hmm. So who influenced you to model and shit? Him? Yeah, pretty much. Like he'd been asking me to do it for years. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, what's your biggest turn off in the man? Um, like initially, dirty ears. Like I just look at like if he has some like some dirty ass ears, like a lot of earwax and stuff. <laughs> it says a lot about hygiene. Oh, you say he just don't get in the shower, nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't know how to clean himself for real. Yeah. If he has some dirty ears, I can't, I can't fuck with it. What's the qualities you look for into a man like dating a nigga? Um, if he's well spoken, like well educated, where he's from. But his morale is. And you don't like rappers. Yeah, I already, we already talked. You, know <laughs> you say you don't like rappers. I just feel like they're very, they, they live a very fast life. Not very, not, no long, longevity into that life sometimes. Why? What? What is it with, with you and rappers? Like, that shit crazy. I mean, like, if they're really hood, like, if it's a gangster rapper, I really don't think I have the mindset to be a gangster rapper's wife. Oh, so you would talk to, like, pretty Ricky type dudes and... No. <laughs> <laughs> no. Probably, like, a college graduate or some shit. What's the best uh, dating experience you ever had? Oh, we was just vibing out. We went to get ice cream in the middle of winter. It's like really? snowing outside. We went to it's cold as hell. Yeah, it was cold as hell. I we went, went to, to um, yeah, we went to Franklin uh, ice cream spot in Philadelphia. It's like That's a, the shit out there. That's, That's the like shit. That's like Yeah, people walk outside. We people there was just like a line outside for this ice cream. That's how good it is. And it's handmade. What you get? I get the French vanilla. I'm very classic. Yeah. Okay, so okay. it's so good though. So I will stand right now in the middle of the cold just to get that ice cream. But it was just vibe and it was fun. It was funny. Uh, I'm skipping these questions. I don't even know where to go to. I don't know what's the next question. <laughs> but uh, Wait, I don't know. You, which one I didn't get, get on you? 
Does it irritate? That's the best. That's the best question you can ever ask me. That's for too long. Does it, like irrit- <laughs> does it get irritating when people use the term Instagram model? Um, does it feel like no, it takes see, away from it. the I'm credibility too, of I'm professional too far model? To- <laughs> um, you said what? absolutely. Now, what is it? What's the word? Does it get irritating when people use the Instagram model? I, it gets very inter- um, irritating, especially when you're published and in stores. Like you see me on a window, you see me in multiple windows, but you want to call me an Instagram model? I think it's very interesting. Um, the term Instagram model, I can't, I can't really say there's a term for Instagram model because a lot of girls get paid for like fit tea. A lot of girls get paid for like being in music videos or shaking their ass online, like. I don't. The, you been in the music video before? No, absolutely not. I haven't. You don't want to, or you gotta be a really good rapper for me to be. A, you know, really? You gotta have some good ass bars. Period. You feel me? <laughs> but uh, the 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 word Instagram model, I think it gets really misused, especially like because if if I'm not on a runway, let's be honest, I'm five four. It's like good, really good chance I'm not gonna be on the runway. Doesn't mean I'm not a model. I don't know shit about the modeling, but what you can't, you gotta be like kind of tall, huh? If you wanna be on a runway, yeah, I'm not a runway. Oh. I'm, I'm, I have to be 5'10, 110 pounds, I'm 5'4, 120. That means right. I'm fat and short to them. But I could do commercial, I could do a lot of shit. There's a lot of things I've well, done. You're fine in the mind. motherfucker, you pretty as hell. <laughs> do so, your thing, keep going crazy. Things. There's a lot of things you could do besides runway. Mm-hmm. And I feel like if you're not on runway, they can say you're Instagram model. But you can find me in stores, so it doesn't matter. Feel me? My baby. We got one more question in there. Well, you don't feel it like up. reading. Let me Aside from modeling, what other things? I thought I'm asked definitely you in college. I'm definitely in the military. I you in college? I'm in college. Yeah. I'm not what college you attend to? Rutgers University. Rikers. Rockers. I was gonna say, what the fuck? Rikers? Rutgers. Rikers Island? Rutgers. The fuck? <laughs> you like it? It's good, yeah. I'm on my last year. I can't wait to graduate. Oh, okay. But I still got it on law school. What you majoring in, here, you say? Political science. So if you need me. Yeah, it don't mm-hmm. sound like I need you in that field, but. What? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, we wrapping it up, man. Vlog in this bitch. The iciest motherfucking uh, model you see right now. You feel me? For okay. sure, Mag, man. Models in the rapper shit, man. <laughs> Whatever the shit called, man. I forgot McFadden, but shout out to my nigga, man. We 100 all day. Bye, love. Uh.